Here's what a typical day of spending looks like for a stay-at-home mom who doesn't have Target and Starbucks money. Obviously, the day starts off with breakfast and a nap. My baby ate a spinach and egg omelet and I ate air. After she woke up from her nap, we did some chores together and I made her leftovers for lunch. Which, in girl math, is a free lunch. And double free because I also ate the chicken marsala for lunch. After lunch, I did some more chores that are always free because I am the maid. And nobody pays me. My work is pro bono. Right here is where my husband must have gotten home from work because I went to the store. I can't do that until he gets home because we only have one car. Anyway, I ran to the dollar store to get hot dogs and buns so we could have a cookout. Yes, on a public grill in the park, it's fine. I ended up picking up a few party supplies for my daughter's birthday this weekend, so the total was like $25. Getting your family together and doing a picnic in the park is a really fun way to go out to eat when you can't afford to go out to eat. Our outing really tired the baby out, so we got home, gave her a bath, and put her 